obesity epidemic, in my opinion, is a 15-year problem, and it starts by getting with two-year-olds and preschoolers and kindergartens and teaching them to cook by simply cooking ourselves and getting them involved in the process. When we get our kids involved, such as the Junior League's Kids in the Kitchen process, hands-on activities, we empower them to want to make healthy life choices. It takes a village, but it takes a community, just like the Junior Leagues are doing in every city in this nation and in four countries with kids in the kitchen. They are banding together, they're uniting the healthcare districts, the, the community partners. You know, like here today, we've got exercise going on, we've got cooking demonstrations, we've got medical demonstrations, we've got food portion control demonstrations. It takes everybody, not just one person. If the parents did it alone, they go to the school and everything is lost. If the school does it alone, they go home and there's no food in the house, then everything is lost, they learn there. It's gotta be everybody. The Junior League's Kids in the Kitchen initiative uh, in year four, it's proven to be the largest and most effective of, uh, initiative of its kind, and that's because of the simplicity of it. Junior Leagues provide the resources. We go into communities that don't have resources. We give them free backpacks and we give them free food, and you know some of them are providing their only meals of the day. It's it's a lot of things combined. Like I said, it takes a whole community and it actually takes our entire country. Because if we don't, we're going to have a bigger problem than we have now with gas and the and the, and the uh, stock market. Because our children are our greatest resource. It's such an important issue right now, especially because the statistics of childhood obesity just keep going up and um, type two diabetes, heart failure, even in young kids. So it's something that is definitely um, at the forefront right now. We're able to, um, through this event, really promote the topic of exercise, childhood obesity, getting the kids off the couch, getting them out and being active, and um, all the food distributed today is healthy. We were really impressed when we saw the line for the fresh fruit. Kids were clamoring to fill their plates with fresh fruit and dip it in yogurt, and that's so much more exciting than a big bag of chips or something like that. If you get in your kitchen and you start cooking, you too can be an Iron Chef. And in this instance, an Iron Kid. Okay, we're going to play a game that I call Name That Tropical Fruit because I come from Florida where we have tropical weather, the warm weather. I'm going to close my eyes then. You ready? Who knows what this is? Okay, you're all out if you said kiwi. Now, who didn't say it? Keep your hands up. What is it? Kiwi? Come on up front. I, we were just getting started. She's she's already been picked. Okay, so let's get ready to play Iron Kid Chef Challenge. On your mark, get set. Go. Okay. Can we hold up one of those plates of pancakes? Can I have it? And I'll give it right back. Now remember, look at it for creativity. Here's our beautiful pancakes. Come on over, man. So, so we're going to stand up here. Okay. Let's, I'm going up here with Mario, and we're going to announce the winner. Before I announce it, let's hear it for our challengers, the challengers. On the other end. We've got, where's the other one? Okay, we've got them down there. We've got the monkeys. Let's hear it for the monkey challengers. And on the end, what's your name? Stephen Oliver. Stephen Oliver. Let's hear it for Stephen Oliver. He was so cool. Okay, and Mario, right here. Can I have that money? We have a winner here. The judges' scores have been tabulated. And Mario, who is the winner of the Iron Kid Chef Challenge? The Challengers! The Challengers! Let's hear it! Yay! Okay. Coming out, coming out. And because everybody's the winner, of course we have Cup Challenger Cup for the Challengers, which is going to be the Challenger one. These little monkeys! Smoothie sample, right? <laughs>